Okay, we moved on to question two on progress check number seven. Um, it's a, uh, another means question, and it's another confidence interval question. Um, so what it talks about is emperor penguins and their swim speed, kilometers uh, per hour. So what it says is we took a random sample of 31 emperor penguins. They had a mean swim speed of 9.771 kilometers an hour with a standard deviation of 0 0.944. It asked us to run a 95% confidence interval. So we go through the panic process again. P, mu equals the true mean swim speed of an emperor penguin. So again, parameter mu, uh, true mean, and context. That's what they're looking for. Uh, A is my assumptions. Again, random, independent, and normal. Random is the same. It states random, so we can use mu sub x bar. So the mean of our sampling distribution of means is 9.771. Independent. We're going to do 10n again, 10 times 31, 310. Again, please state, I'll assume more than 310 emperor penguins. So that allows us to figure out the standard error. The standard error is uh, mu of x bar, I'm sorry, sigma of x bar, 0 0.944 divided by the square root of 31. And that simplifies to 0.1695. Normal. Okay, so we're going to do the same normal check. Uh, we're fortunate that we're above 30. So again, since our sample size is greater than or equal to 30, the central limit theorem allows us to say it's approximately normal. However, to get the critical value here for 95% confidence, we're going to use a T star as opposed to a Z star. And the way we do that is degrees of freedom. And degrees of freedom are sample size minus 1. So in this case, we have 30 degrees of freedom. So we go to that same table that we use, table B, We'd go to the 30 row for degrees of freedom. We drag our finger across until we found the column for 95%. That's 2.042. So we have the three pieces we need, the point estimator, the standard error, and the critical value. So now what we're going to do is we're going to construct a one sample T interval for true mean at 95% confidence. Again, this formula is on the formula sheet. In a way, we'll do a video that will talk about that. Um, plugging in the numbers, 9.771 plus or minus 2.042, the critical value times our standard error, 0 0.944 over the square root of 31. And again, this is going to be a calculator thing. So we're going to go ahead with our calculator, and we are going to do stat, test, and on this case, we want to do number 8 for T interval. And we're going to do stats. We're going to put in stats. So in this case, the stats we're going to put in are the mean 9.771, the standard deviation 0 0.944, our sample size is 31, our confidence level is 0.95, we calculate, and that gives us eventually 9.4247 to 10.117. So what we're going to do is copy those numbers down exactly. Light again, a little better. 9.4247, 10.1117. Uh, final statement, we are 95% confident that the interval from 9.4247 to 10.117 kilometers an hour, there's some more context, captures the true mean swimming speed of emperor penguins. Um, so that would be your full uh, panic, your full confidence interval for means.